Development Corporation is seeking more than $100 million for improvements to the LEAP district in Lebanon. News 18's Vinny Martirano has more on these developments. $50 million that the IEDC is requesting will be used to supply 25 million gallons of water to Lebanon per day. The other 50 will be used to buy land and develop the LEAP district as a whole. According to the state budget meeting agenda, the IEDC is asking the state to move $50 million from the deal closing fund to the Indiana Finance Authority. The IFA will use the money to secure bond financing, which will, quote, extend infrastructure. News 18 previously reported all future developments in the LEAP project are put on hold due to water availability. That extended infrastructure will be able to provide 25 million gallons of water per day to Lebanon. The request says the water will be used to support new companies coming to the LEAP district. The IEDC nor the IFA were able to tell me where the water will be coming from or any details of the potential project that will be bringing the water to Lebanon. The IEDC is also asking for another $36 million to support three projects within the LEAP district. The money will be used to buy land, deposits, and option payments on 1,850 acres in the LEAP district. The agenda says the three companies are engaged in advanced computing, information technology, and biopharmaceutical manufacturing. The IEDC was not able to say who those companies are. They also are asking to move an additional $15 million from the deal closing fund to upgrade roadways, installing a roundabout, and installing utilities to serve companies in the LEAP district. The IEDC deferred all questions to the IFA. The IFA nor the IEDC were able to tell me if there's any connection between the originally proposed pipeline between Tippecanoe County and Boone County and the newly proposed 25 million gallons of water per day plan. They also weren't able to tell me how long 25 million gallons of water per day could support the LEAP project. Thursday morning is the State Budget Committee meeting, and News 18 will have more updates as they become available. Reporting in West Lafayette, Vinnie Mortorano, News 18.